All right, test, test. Uh, we're just about to start mailbag. Uh, and I think my mic is going to be working, but let's find out. And then I guess we don't have to mic you if you're going to be in here. I can just re I have to repeat everything you say anyway, right? No, I'll be in there. You want a mic? Here, I'll get you the mic then. Yeah. It feels weird because I feel weird like things crashing right now. You can just forget that it's there. Nobody minds. No, I didn't. I'll sit over there. And then that, that camera also does? No. Okay. It'll just be too weird. That's fine. Here, just put this on. You can just ignore it. In fact, I'll put it, uh, well, no, I'll put it right there. Yeah, no, put it here. 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 No. here. Which part is the microphone? Yep. Better be quiet now. You took a breath and you're like... Mm-hmm. I can't breathe. Uh-huh. All right, everybody. Well, here we are. Uh, this is sort of Christmas wrap-up in a way. I know I'm pretty far from the camera. Let me see if I can uh, zoom it in to make up that difference. Of course, we want to see what these kids are doing, so maybe not. Yeah, it's worth it to just stay like this, I think. Let me check the angle real quick, and then I'll check to make sure you can hear me, because I don't know. Um, eh, I guess it's all right. Not the most flattering angle, but that's okay, too. Yeah, you said it. Okay, uh, now where is Discord? There it is. Good, both mics work. Okay, fantastic. Please breathe, DJ. <laughs> yes. uh, okay, good, good. Well, there we are. Um, let's, uh, let's see. The big news, of course, is that Squall and Wellingtons have gone home to their doctors yesterday. They left uh, yesterday morning. And we've already seen photos of them settling into their new house, and it seems like they're doing very well. Um, I was pleased to see that Wellingtons is already exploring the faucet and the water at the new place, because he's so fascinated with that. So that's got to be fun. And I'll be excited to hear how they did uh, overnight for their first night and all that kind of stuff. Um, uh, the, it's funny how just the two of them being gone makes such a difference. You know, this, the whole house having immediately switched from we've got just so many kittens here to like, where are all the kittens? Um, but uh, these two are, and their kitten mom and Serenity are all uh, uh, still available and fun. So we do have some fun kittens here. Uh, I, their kitten mom, I mean, uh, you know, the kitten mom, I guess. She's sort of adopted all the kittens, though. She's such a good mom. Uh, Tilla is such a good cat. She never starts any trouble. Sometimes she gets in trouble, um, but that's not her fault. She always tries to de-escalate. So, uh, yeah, all right. That's, the, as far as I'm aware, the only news I can think of for the week. Um, so let's get right into the mail part of the mailbag. Uh, let's see, there are a bunch of letters, which I assume are uh, mostly Christmas cards that are kind of coming in at the last minute. So I think we're going to have a whole bunch of those to go through first. I got the bear over here hanging on to them for us. And uh, we will just start opening them. Once again, I didn't bother covering up all the addresses on these, so I'm going to try to make sure that, well, I'm far enough away from you guys now that it might be academic. <laughs> this is a very cute uh, little kitten with sort of a three-dimensional head and a Christmas wreath, a tensile Christmas wreath around his head. Uh, that's a... Oh! And it makes a lot of noise. Let's see what they think. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay, kids. Oh. Oh. Maybe it's not. I think they recognize it's... Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> So much for always de-escalating. <laughs> Come here. you just got to prove me wrong, don't you? She also loves to sit in my lap, uh, although she's not going to do that right now either, I bet. So, dear Mr. A, DJ, faculty, mom cats, non-mom cats, and kittens, uh, wishing you all a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Love, Hoodwink, Flim Flam, and Kelly. That's so sweet. Aw, little Hoodwink and Flim Flam. Those were great names. What a great class name. Uh, fantastic. All right. 
That's a very cute card. Where am I sitting? Yeah, I don't know. You don't could know. sit on the sofa. I know you worry about that, but it, it can take your weight no problem. No, it takes no. mine no problem. We're not supposed to sit. Why not? On things that are made for... Okay, those are both to sit on, too. Ah. <sighs> Those are made for people to sit on, you know. Hmm. Here we have an envelope in an envelope. Oh, this says Aunt Susie of Camp Crazy Kitty right on it. Hi, you know, there's a chair uh, that you can put on the floor. It's right in this front closet, ready to go. I don't mind. Okay. Uh, this is very sparkly little hey. kittens wearing Christmas hats. Awesome. And it says Jingle All the Way on it. And on the inside... It says, Mr. A, Dr. DJ, faculty, with a T-E-A, mom, cats, kittens, and the entire K-A community. Um, oh, jingle all the way to a perfect holiday. Happy holidays to one and all, nose boops and spoogles, Aunt Susie of Camp Crazy Kitty. Thank you, Aunt Susie. And you've drawn a heart that is, has cat ears, and the S in Susie is a cat. Very creative. I like it. Uh, we'll put that right there. This one is from the San Diego Humane Society. Oh, I'm suspecting somebody probably made a donation. That's good. That's very good. Uh, contribution has been made to the San Diego Humane Society in celebration of Kitten Academy by Lapis Laz and Mr. Laz. Aw, thank you so much. That is really sweet. I see that they're, the featured animals on their card, which is, you know, a pretty basic card. It's just got three animals, a dog, a cat, you would expect. The third animal is an owl. I wonder how many animals are at the San Diego Humane Society. Hmm. That's interesting. All right. Uh, so I, I really appreciate that, by the way. I always say uh, that making donations to your local shelter is a great thing to do. And uh, it does kind of pay twice if you do it in our name because I get to appreciate it, too. I think that's wonderful. So this is from Pasto Mayo, it says right in the return address. And we've got it sealed with a little sparkly bow. That thing uh, came in mailbag the other day. It's a little electronic door hanging toy, and it is the the, the top part is so sturdy. I, I feel like the motor spindle might be the part that breaks first, but the the actual door clamp is the strongest one I think we've ever seen. So uh, let's see. This is cute little kittens in a basket with a Santa hat on. It says, "Not a creature was stirring." Here's to a perfect holiday season. Mr. A and Dr. DJ, I think it would take a Christmas miracle for this card to reach you before Christmas. So I guess you could think of this card as a holiday extra. Because of the chaos that is my life as of late, I wasn't able to find time to design a card this year either. Regardless of that, I wish everyone in your household a great holiday season and an excellent new year ahead. Happy holidays from Pesto Mayo. Thank you so much, Pesto Mayo. Uh, don't worry about designing your card. This is a cute card. Any card is good, and uh, I certainly understand not having time to do extra. I think uh, just sending us a card is already extra enough. So uh, thank you for that very much. What? I know. Till, Till and Drizzle are going to get into it because they've always had a little bit of tension. Drizzle. And they both want to play with the toy. So yeah, Drizzle is the one. Yeah, Drizzle does get like super uh, possessive about her toys and stuff. And for some reason, Till doesn't always defer to her like she does to everybody else. Yeah, but then the, the difference between them is that Sprout is so just loving to everybody. Like she's just she rubs on every faculty and the, all the cats. She met um, uh, Cal yesterday, yeah. and I don't think that I saw got some of it on camera, but not the initial meeting where she goes right up to Cal and just starts rubbing on her cheek like uh, like any you know cats that really like each other, like Maggie does with the other faculty. Uh, it was adorable. She's just a, such a Sprout sweetheart. So she and her sweet. sister together, they make me think of, um, DJ's not going to be able to help me with this, the names of the sisters in Guardians of the Galaxy, although neither one of them is especially sweet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Sprout. Sprout. Okay, uh, let's see here. This is really cool. It is a, it's like a painted Christmas tree, and then it's decorated with rhinestones to be the ornaments, and it says, Merry Christmas. It's just really pretty. Oh, and it says, okay to read on stream. Joyful wishes for a season filled with happiness and peace. Hello, Mr. A, Dr. DJ, all cats and kittens at KA, and to everyone watching. Just a note to wish you all a very Merry Christmas, happiest of holidays, and a happy, healthy New Year. 
I almost said Mew year. Uh, Mr. A and DJ, thank you for all you do for the mom cats, kittens, and pregnots who are lucky enough to come to KA. Please use the donation I've included for Teaspoons Medical Expenses uh, Fund. Thank you again for all that you do. I'm so thankful to have found this corner of joy on the internet. Best wishes, uh, Michelle, who is Italian Angel 73 on Discord. Thank you very much. That's a super generous donation. I really appreciate it. I'm going to put it right here in our uh, donation box, I guess. Uh, and I'm going to put your card right here so everybody can enjoy it. Uh, thank you for that. Teaspoon? What? He just, I don't know, he kind of what? jump fell off of the sofa. What's buddy. up, buddy? What are What's you doing? What's going on? Who knows? All right, this one's sealed with a dinosaur. Oh, and it is from uh, Dino Ruth. That's fantastic. It's also got dinosaurs on the front. The uh, card is a sort of traditional uh, colonial home with a snowman out front and a decorated Christmas tree. And it's got a Christmas tree inside you can see through the windows. Uh, it says, celebrate the beauty of the holiday season. Greetings, K.A. folk. It's been a long time. I've been busy with work and my musical groups, but not too busy to check in on K.A. now, now and then. Here's hoping you are well and have lots of spoogly kittens. Best wishes for a happy kitten-filled new year from Dino Ruth. Well, Dino Ruth, thank you so much. It is it's wonderful to hear from you. Um, I'll never forget that hat you wore the first time that we met you with all the dinosaurs on it. It was very cool, which also reminds me in turn that I've got to uh, wear my cat uh, fishing outfit a little bit more often. I did wear it on the stream at least once recently. Uh, it's up in my closet. The, the, it's got the hat with all the cat toys on it and the vest with all the cat toys on it. Hmm. Kind of a similar feel. Uh, such a cool idea, too. All right. This is, um, let's see, sent from Powell and the USC Cats. All right. Uh, familiar correspondent. Oh, wow, this is really sealed. Hey, 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 hey it's okay. It's okay. You stop with that. She wasn't even looking at you. Wow, still has a problem with just one cat. Just one cat out of all the cats, huh? Well, how does it start back up again? She just got too close until just... No, I mean this. Oh, that. I don't know. Did you press the button? Can you oh, reach the button? Probably not. Yeah, I don't, it must have a timer on it. It's, it's the first time we put that thing up, so I've, this is our first experience with it. Uh, let's see. There is a little tiny uh, nick in the envelope that I can use to open it from the bottom. There we go, because it's taped up solid. It says, uh, it's got a little, this is a cute little painting. Uh, looks like watercolor and ink. And it's got a kitten looking at Christmas ornaments hung by the window. And he's knocked down two of them. And it says, two down, five to go. Uh, it's adorable. It says to Mr. A, Dr. DJ, esteemed faculty, darling mom cats, all the adorable kittens, Mr. Whiskers, and Aunt. Wishing you, well, you really got everybody. Wishing you all, the, did you guys see um, that uh, Mr. Whiskers made an appearance this week? Uh, maybe that was news too, um, where uh, he was actually in the wall in my bedroom and Maggie and I were listening to him for like, uh, you know, 20 minutes or something. Just He was sort of jumping against the wall on the inside of the wall. And I knew that meant that like he'd, he'd kind of gotten into that space between the two studs and couldn't figure out how to get back up. So I, uh, I drilled him a mouse hole and he came right out into the trap that I'd put there and I brought him outside. Uh, so it's my little success story, I guess. Um, okay. Wishing you all the most wonderful Christmas filled with lots of love, treats and snuggles. Uh, lots of love. Heather, who is Powell and the OC Cats. Uh, also from Poppy and Mushu, thank you for everything you've done and continue to do for all the mum cats and kittens that are lucky enough to find themselves in your loving care. Your dedication to their happiness and well-being is so heartwarming, and I'm extremely grateful for the haven you provide for them and all of us. Wishing you all, human, feline, mousy, or insect, a wonderful 2024 filled with love, good health, fat kitten bellies, and lots and lots of laughter. With much love, uh, Heather, Poppy, and Mushu. P.S. I don't know if you can see this. Uh, <laughs> hmm. K. 
to Akon Dropship Poop. Uh, well, I don't, I, I, I don't know if you can see this, but you didn't have to do that awesome, fantastic, fragile, fancy K Akon Dropship Poop. Also, sorry for my handwriting, and please, uh, something Donkey Shane as you see fit. So, uh, oh, this was bingo. Those were all bingo buzzwords. I see. What? Uh, but I don't know what the I don't know what this word is. C. Right. It looks like C W T C H, but it must be catch, right? Please catch donkey Shane as you see fit. I don't know. I don't know what the word is, but there you go. I hope that got somebody to win bingo already. <laughs> <laughs> This is, this room, oh, does it start again when they pulled on it? I don't know how she started it. All right. Hmm. Maybe it just randomly decides to go once in a while. It's like, uh, it's like Mitch Hedberg says about an escalator, though. It's never, it's never broken. It just, you know, becomes stairs. Mm -hmm. Like this thing, even if it's not pulling up and down, then it's just a regular door hanging toy. Okay. Next up. Uh, let's see. Well, they've uh, canceled the postage right over your name. Let's see what it says on the inside. <laughs> it's a cartoon of Santa and his cats in the sleigh uh, flying over a town. And one of the cats is in the sleigh with him and the other one is like hanging on to the back. Uh, it says, Mr. A and Dr. DJ, Merry Christmas. I hope you two and everyone in KA Land are enjoying a wonderful holiday season. Thank you for all the love and kindness you share with the world through the beautiful cats and kittens. Ramble on from Rody Ann. Thank you, Rody Ann. I think I'm wearing my uh, Let's Get Ready to Ramble t-shirt today. <laughs> so, perfectly. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, all, right. all the conflict. This is enough conflict, you two. I'm going to have to put one of you up. If you're going to keep doing that for no reason. No, re oh, oh, she's really like on edge now. Drizzo. <laughs> it's all Drizzo. Well, mostly all Drizzo. You think by now they would have learned just not to get too close to each other, but then we put up something extremely tempting for them. Uh, Should I turn it off? No, it's, I mean, it's okay. Um, an attract. Uh, what is the legal term for that? Like when you put up a. a trampoline in your backyard and the kids come and jump on it because it was so attractive to them. Uh, wow, I'm losing it now. Okay, so here we have a wonderful watercolor kitty just laying out on his back. Looks exactly like our custard, doesn't he? It's a little custard. And it says, oh, there's also a wonderful gift card in here. Thank you so much for Chewy. Um, happy holidays, Mr. A, Dr. DJ, faculty, and all mom, cats, and baby kitties. I've only been watching your live stream KA for about three years. <laughs> only for three years? That makes us feel like we've been doing this forever, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> it really has been a while. Um, I recently became a Discord member and I enjoy both so much. As everyone says, thank you so very much for all that you do for moms and kittens. You've done this for so long and I truly appreciate it. We need more people like you in this world. Merry Christmas with love, Laura and Kodos. Oh, wow, Kodos. What just happened? She's Scratching. just pulling down the tree. Yeah. Oh, whoa! <laughs> Drizzle. You I don't okay? know how much of that you could see in the mirror, or maybe from the overhead up. camera. Wow. Oh, That's something. Okay. Uh, Laura, Laura, and Kodos, thank you very much. And yes, your uh, your donation will help. Uh, not just a little, a lot. That's super generous. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Wow. I'll put that right in the donation box, and we'll put uh, custard right here for everybody to look at. Same as he does. This is the floor he likes to do it on too. But he is—he's uh, put up right now so that Till can be out, and so is uh, Logan put up. Um, I can't remember what Logan does with Till, but I feel like they Same don't get thing. along. It's weird to think of Logan going after a mom cat, though. That's rare. It's super rare. Yeah, it was really bad. I remember. Yeah. A couple of times. Well, it's really, it's not really bad. It's really bad because of the way she reacts when somebody goes She's after her. She's very nice. She's nice, and she always tries to de-escalate, but the thing is that she, like, you know how Maggie makes all this noise and it's just sound, like there's nothing behind it? She takes it to the next level where she makes a ton of noise and she lays on her back to try to be submissive, and then if the, if the other cat doesn't back off, she, she urinates and sometimes she poops too to kind of be like extra submissive. This is animal behavior. Aww. We've seen that with dogs. Uh, I see, so I've seen it, I should say, 
with dogs that my mom has raised that are like super submissive little dogs. They do the exact same sort of behavior to, to be like, please just leave me alone. I'll do anything you want. Uh, so that's, that's what Till does. And she makes a ton of noise and it's a huge mess. Um, and, uh, I think that's why, like, even though Logan's not a very aggressive cat in general, uh, it seems that way when he kind of won't back off from her because she makes such a production out of how innocent and submissive she is. But she is. She is. No, she is. She's so sweet. Yeah, yeah. But I think that that's, I mean, we know that that kind of submissiveness can tend to set off Maggie in particular. And I don't think it's that it sets off Logan so much as just that he gets blamed for being extra aggressive because of how reactive she is to it. Well, it does make everybody look bad. Yeah, yeah, it does. But uh, but she is a sweetheart. She's sweet. She would do great in most multi-cat households because she does get along well with everybody. But, uh, you know, I guess you'd have to be careful that... It's not a Maggie situation. <laughs> so this is, uh, a, wow, this is a cat in outer space on a pizza flying saucer eating pizza with little pizza angels flying around. Uh, that's a lot of pizza and cats, and it's awesome. <laughs> it says, oh, if a kitten eating pizza in space doesn't make your birthday awesome, then I'm out of ideas. And happy then, birthday. Happy birthday. It says, Dear Mr. A, we both have November birthdays and we both are procrastinators. <laughs> why, <laughs> why do today what we can put off till tomorrow? I knew if anyone would appreciate a late birthday card, it would be us. I mean you. Hope it was a good one. Say hi to Eddie, my sock cat. Most of the, my cats resemble him. Uh, from Stray Cat Strut... Merry Christmas, Mr. A and all cats. Well, that's a great name, by the way. Uh, I've always enjoyed um, that rockabilly. And, um, yeah, happy late birthday to you as well. I, I'll get your card in the mail uh, just in due time, all right? Mm-hmm. So, thank you very much. Oh, not intended for mailbag. All right, we'll just put that one straight aside for now. Um, I found one already that said that and, and took it aside. This one says, okay to read on mailbags. Yeah, I love it. It makes it so easy. Wow, this is such a pretty envelope. Uh, first off, it's got this lovely sort of watercolor um, of a cat. And then it's also got the Day of the Dead sugar skull uh, stamp on it, which is also super cool. And it has the same artwork and then the full version on the back. And it, it does have little uh, Japanese writing on it, which, of course, I can't make heads or tails of. Oh, but here, you can try, uh, because here's the full art on the card. Ooh, and a very generous donation. Okay, I'm going to put the donation right in here. That's awesome. And the card is here. It's beautiful. It's titled Cat Nap. Uh, It says it is from the National Museum of Women in the Arts Award of Distinction, uh, Paula Schrader. Schroeder? Schrader. Chinese brush painting. Oh, uh, Chinese, sorry. Done with minimal strokes. Yes. It's beautiful, and it's Paula, the artist's own cat, apparently. That's so cool. Wow. Huh. Well, it's really beautiful. Okay. Uh, It's the inside of the card. Um, Dear Mr. A and Dr. DJ, I have so enjoyed KA for a few years after someone told me about it. I am so impressed by your dedication to the cats and kitties. Uh, kittens. kittens. I am on Discord to stay in touch and see the kittens, but I don't post, and I don't even know what my handle is. <laughs> That's super lurker. All right, fantastic. I enjoy hearing about your time in Illinois since I lived in Chicago for 35 years. When I moved to Arizona, I adopted a cat who looks a little like she could be Till's much older sister. She's now over 20 years old. I know you. Uh, I know you have lots of expenses with the menagerie. And I just wanted to help. Best wishes for your continued great work. Sincerely, Linda. Linda, that is super sweet. Thank you very much. And uh, that is a very generous donation that you sent. Uh, I think um, this is beautiful as well. Um, the, your cat being over 20 is fantastic. That's a, that's a great old age for a cat. And uh, I only hope that all of ours make it that long. Okay, we have another not for mailbag here. That's great. So a lot of these are like personal family um, Christmas cards, so that's why there's so many that are not for mailbag. It's not like a bunch of bad news or people yelling at me so far. My <laughs> goodness. Uh, just so you know. 
Oh, this is cute. It's a dog and a cat decorating the tree together, and it says, "May your holidays be furry and bright." Um, and it looks like a well, there's watercolor and ink again. Um, okay to read on stream. I appreciate that, dear Mr. A and Dr. DJ. Thank you for your attentive care of all who come to the academy, and for your generosity in opening your home to strangers on the internet. A friend introduced me to KA in June 2020. It was a highlight in an otherwise bad year, and I've been a fairly regular viewer ever since. I've not written in before, but it seemed a long past time to say thanks for all you do. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year from Cindy, who is Lime on Discord, and also Maya and Hannah. Uh, thank you so much to Lime. Uh, that's a very cute card, and I just I love hearing from people who've been with us for a while, um, but uh, are sort of. Um, communicating for the first time. It's, it's fun uh, to see that, so thank you so much. All right, we're going to go straight into the packages. This was just piled in with the letters, so we'll start here. This is from Mishi, and oh, oh, Mishi has sent us um, uh, two journal and keepsake books for us to enjoy. It says, your cat here, and it's got a, a little uh, place to put in a photo of your cat right on the front. It says, my adorable cat. And then it's got, uh, I'm going to guess, a journal and keepsake. Look at that. You can write how we met, all about you, That's and paw prints, tail. Wow. Oh, like a tail print, I suppose. Paste your photos here. Oh, it's got it's got little phrases that you should fill in on your it's best really days. Cute. On your best days, you look like this. Put a photo here. But when you wake up with all your fur all skew, you still look adorable. Put your photo here. <laughs> These are cute little photo prompts. I love it. Write in your own first with your cat on the lines below. Well, maybe we can get DJ to do one of these for Teaspoon before uh, he's like all grown up. I realize that by the time he gets his surgery, he will have been here almost an entire year. Well, longer probably. Yeah, he doesn't seem like a year old cat. <laughs> but uh, it's a big question for us whether he's going to sort of grow more after he gets his surgery or if he's sort of done at this point size-wise. So that'll be interesting to see. Uh, thank you for sending these uh, in case I don't does ever get to say, my... Does it say who that's for? Uh, it doesn't say who it's for, actually. Let's, maybe I should look for a note just if to be sure because it doesn't... It would be nice for endowments. It would be nice, I think, also for because... an adopter to get to enjoy, but maybe we would have to fill in the beginning of it for them. Well, they or they could fill it in from all the pictures on Discord. Yeah. It doesn't. There's no note included, but uh, I was going to say that go to just in case I don't get to the wonderful embroidery project that I was given. <laughs> you're not going to get to it. Oh, so you say that, we'll, but you're only right. I think um, we'll make it part of endowments. It's a really sweet thing. It is really do. sweet that someone I think would really appreciate. Uh, I love having DJ here for her input on things. It makes it so wonderful. So. Mm -hmm. Uh, the adopters did leave us a bag yesterday before they left with their kittens. And I think it looks like it was probably a pretty good trade. This is full of stuff. Uh. <laughs> Barter. We're working the barter system here yeah. at Kitten Academy now. <laughs> I'll tell you what. Uh, I'll give you two kittens for some newspapers and, uh, uh, mm. I guess, tchotchkes. Ch 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 I can't say tchotchkes. Okay, there we go. Uh, this is, I was in Seattle recently, the rest are from Colorado Springs. This is very cute, though. It's got a kitten right on it, and it says smitten with an arrow pointing at the kitten. Mm -hmm. This is, oh, I see, the stranger from Seattle, and it's how to survive a Seattle winter. Uh, with the mm -hmm. coziest coffee shops, cocktail and cookie recipes, and toasty gift ideas. Uh, that looks super cute. And then the other ones, like you say, are from closer to home for the new kids. The Pikes Peak Bulletin with the, uh, it looks like, water polo and the Our Community News. Very cool. With the uh, Salvation Army front and center. Awesome. Well, I'm excited about reading those. You guys know that I love to, to uh, read. Okay, to read on stream. Oh, perfect. Um, I love to read like local papers especially. I think that's really fun. Oh, this is cool. Tillian. Wow. This is a mail delivery cat, and it says, looks like this is for you. Check out the art on that. Pretty cool, huh? Oh, man. Can you see him? Mm -hmm. It says, dear Mr. A and Dr. DJ, isn't this the cutest card? The cat has mail for you for once. 
It's by a local Denver artist who does a lot of animal and coffee themed work. We just love them. It's、uh, Anna Miller dot com. Arna, is it Arna Miller or Anna Miller? Arna. Oh, it's A R N A. Okay, I just made that into an N in my head, but it's very clearly an R here. So A R N A M I L L E R dot com. It is really cute. The little kitten's face too is just so like serious about making this delivery.、Mm-hmm. Uh, thank you for taking such wonderful care of every creature under your roof. Even the occasional mice get treats and a ride to their final destinations. What? Happy New Year to you, DJ, the faculty, the mom cats, and kittens. We promise to take good care of Squall and Wellington's、oh. love. Not that Ari and Patrick. Thank you so much.、Uh, this is this is wonderful. And you brought a bunch of stuff here, and I know、uh, DJ had already taken a little pic,、uh, peek because she mentioned one of the things. But this is、uh, not it. This is the fresh baked treats for the faculty. I think Treats Unlimited is a chain, but I've not seen a location anywhere but Kansas City. Uh, all natural ingredients: oats, applesauce, honey, canola oil, eggs, and、uh, oh, bonito, which are the dried、uh, fish flakes that I've actually got a bag of. That I wow, does it go bad? How how long does it take for those things to go bad? Oh, I should think、yeah. about clearing some of that stuff out. I haven't I haven't made sushi in a long time, and I've got all of those. And、um, there you go. Do you want to try、Jillian? one? Yeah, I just thought I'd see if anybody wanted to try one while we were sitting here. They're a little big. I think we might have to crumble them up for some of the kittens. Oh, but she's interested. All right, let's see if she can figure it out. She likes. <laughs> she, gra- it. she grabs it and shakes it. Oh, okay, it's a little soft too. I didn't expect them to be so soft. I thought they were going to be super crunchy. Someone's running. Yes,、yeah, so、I did hear a kitten running, but where? Where was it? Upstairs. Yeah. Coming down. Kitties. Who was that?、Drizzle? It must have been Drizzle. Yeah, she's the only one I don't see. Do you、try? want to try one too? Here, I'll let you try half of one. Okay, you can work that out. I almost want to eat the other one. They look like people food. Actually, yeah. I mean, they must have heard the bag. If you just oh, like, I see. Yeah. Do that all and, the time. And、uh, I think probably wouldn't be too bad to eat the putting the fish flakes in there is a little weird, but all the rest of the ingredients are like perfectly、uh, edible cookie ingredients with the honey to make them a little sweet. I'm almost tempted to just try one.、Mm. DJ's frowning. Okay, all right then. So、uh, then, I mean, this is the part I know DJ peeked at, and she said, "Oh my gosh,、uh, this is." It says right on here. Whoops. We imagine DJ has、uh, DJ washes her hands a lot. Here is some of my favorite lotion. And this is Dream Cream from Lush, and I now get a chance to tell all of you that、uh, DJ has、uh, like a Lush、um, obsession、uh, habit. I don't know. All I know is that it's、uh, very frequently boxes come to the door、uh, filled with Lush stuff, and I see these these、uh, really cool all over the place, and they smell so good. Every single thing from them smells great, and they each have these little stickers on them with a picture of the person that made this, and.、Uh, And their name and when and everything on it, which makes it super like personalized. I'm gonna smell this. Yeah. Oh, that's pleasant. That's uh, it's sort of it's not as strong <laughs> as some of the ones that. You're gonna you're gonna try to describe it. I'm trying to guess what it smells like. Yeah, it smells to me sort of. There's a little hint of peppermint in there,、mm-hmm. and.、Um, <laughs> it smells sort of like it's got a. Why did it do this? It's got like a a bit of a starlight mint、um, smell to it, but there's something else too. What is starlight?、Too. You know the little red mints that you get at a restaurant.、Uh, I think that's what those are called. Okay, it doesn't have any mint in it or starlight. Really? It's definitely got a little minty. Well, it says dream cream, so there you go.、It、so DJ is rose, super excited to find that there was lavender, cocoa, and oat. Wait, what? Lavender, cocoa, and oat? Rose. Oh, maybe that's the floral that I was getting as the rose, but no, it's got to be starlight mint. I still smell starlight mint in there. What is starlight mint? The little red peppermints, the red and white striped round peppermints that you get. I.、Um, all right, doesn't matter. My nose could be deceiving, deceiving me.、Um, let's see. 
This says, oh, hey, this is so cool. I looked in here and I saw candy bars and I thought, oh, man, I was just trying to figure out what to, how to dispose of the rest of the chocolate now that I've eaten way too much of everybody's chocolate. But, in fact, the note says, we almost got you famous chocolates from Kansas City, but you've been working out, so have a bunch of protein bars instead. Nice. That's super thoughtful of you. And uh, these two make like a great breakfast or something, right? Wow, some of these look really good. Bear Bells Protein Bar Cookies and Cream. Mm, that sounds mm. really good. These are basically like candy bars for people who work out. So that's it's the best of both worlds. Now, these are some cool um, chocolate cookie. I'm sorry, chocolate cookie butter flavored Misfits, plant powered. Uh, these look like some real sort of artisanal. Um, energy bars so that's wow. exciting and then the bag that you put this all in is super cool it's too really cool it's sort of semi uh, transparent made up of a bunch of uh, strands sort of felted together like loosely felted or glued it's beautiful it looks like till gave up on the, trying to eat that oh and this one got crunched up and then left too oh. that's fine they had fun chest they in just them. don't know what it is yet yeah they'll figure it out or we'll find a cat that loves them or i'll just eat them because they sound pretty good um mm -hmm. i could get used to fish <laughs> in my cookies why don't i make more fish cookies mm. there's probably an answer to that okay um then there's one more thing in here another bag in the bag and this one says okay mountain standard goods Oh, it's another card from an artist that I recognize. I think this is the famous artist Arna Miller. Nice. <laughs> I know. Look at me. Uh, that Denver artist has a Drunk Cat series. You're getting this particular print because you're abstemious. Whoa, abstemious. Uh, mm -hmm. It means you don't drink. I see. Like uh, to abstain, I suppose. To abstain. To abstem. Steam? Abstain. I abstain from drinking. Sure, mm -hmm. I do. Uh, no, thank you. I'm just drinking milk tonight, is what it says. <laughs> it's super cute. cute. Oh, it's adorable. Thank you. There's a whole Christmas cats. Um, oh, have you looked up the, the yeah. artist already? Okay, Arna Miller. Then on top of that, we have this little tchotchke, big tchotchke, and it is heavy, too. Like, this is serious. Someone has carved and, and burnt a, a bear holding a sign that says Colorado, and it is a wood carving and wood burning. Uh, it's very pretty. Mm -hmm. Uh, it's got a great texture, and it says, Because carved bears are a Colorado thing, and this one is too cute. It is indeed too cute. On the one side, it also it says, Welcome. Uh, and then on the other side, it says, Colorado. So if we wanted to, we could put him right out front and just say, Welcome. Or we could put him right out front and say, Colorado. And people would be like, I don't understand. Mm -hmm. um, but it's cute, and it, it's a very sweet. He is, he's got the most adorable face. And I think um, it's, a, it's a nice way for me to remember Squall and Wally Rizzle, every time one, I look at Rizzle, it. you're one cat. Yeah, she doesn't sound like one cat, she though. She is like running four. like a stampede of one. Uh, thank you so much for this. Like I said, it'll be, it'll be a great way. Every time I see it, I'll be thinking of you and Welly and Squall. Yeah. So that's wonderful. Okay. Um, well, thank you so much for all of that. Like I said, I, I think we got a pretty good deal. Uh, in our little barter system, a <laughs> barter economy at KA. Mm. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, I'm going to move this right over here. I'm going to put him in his bag since it, it looks like it's sort of themed for him for now. There we go. All right, move all this sort of out of the way. This I want to put someplace nice before it gets ruined by everybody, so... Um, I'll set it over here. Okay. Let's see. Here I can put it with these. It can go right up to my office. Uh, this DJ I know is going to take away. Um, are you going to... Well, we'll figure that out yeah. after. Let's just keep rolling. Okay. Let's see. We have a long package here that is attention... Oh, whoops. A little late. Uh, K.A. and Squellies. Um, that's okay. I, I said, you know, this is going to happen. Uh, it does happen. And, you know, we'll get it sent to them um, in due time, I suppose. Probably. There's the green knife. We'll use that one. Okay. I'm guessing just from the length of the box that this must be some sort of cat wand. There 
It's got a note that almost came out of the box on the way here. <coughs> and it says, part one of two, enjoy your gift. Merry Christmas, Mr. A, Dr. DJ, all cool cats and cats. <coughs> P.S. Are you opening presents Christmas Day on camera from Breezy Melody 1? Well, this must have taken a while to get to us. Um, but the answer, Breezy Melody 1, is yes. And this is not at all a wand. Oh, oh, surprised, huh? Mm. This is a wonderful uh, blue and gray cat ball, like the ones that DJ has bought oh. in the past. Uh, that's a oh, wonderful. We haven't had that in a while. Yeah, we haven't had one of these out in quite a while. These are the ones that are like an armadillo that are all folded yeah. up, and you can cool. uh, spread it out into a ball or into a bed. Or as we find most often, it ends up in the shape of a taco holder, and the little kittens like to sit in the slats like they were little kitten tacos. Mm -hmm. So um, that's a, that's really wonderful. Thank you so much, Breezy Melody One. Um, I know that the outside says attention, K A and Squellies, uh, but um, the inside just says for uh, Mr. A, Dr. DJ, all the cool cats and kittens. So I think that's something that we can deploy uh, when we find the proper room for it. Now Ari is finishing off these little bits of treats over here, and he seems like he's enjoying it. Let's see if he'll also try a big one. Here, let me move these bags so you can see him a little bit. There we go. So this is the uh, the D period ball that DJ, uh, like I said, uh, I think you were the first one to buy one of these for us, right? And then uh, we've had a couple that people have sent in, but not for a very long time, like you say. Uh, they're nice. They're very nice. Okay. I'm going to just slide some of this stuff out of the way a little bit more and... We'll keep right on rolling. Uh, Why, this one is open. Does not have any clues on the outside, but there is a note. Oh, pounce on the cards. Till is the cutest when she starts zooming and kittening. Mm -hmm. She gets wild too. She'll take toys and throw them around and Oh, this is part two of two. Okay, perfect timing. Enjoy your gift. Cat wand feather bird toys. This is for Squall and Wellingtons. Reviews say birds are heavy but sturdy for close-up play. I hope duders will share your new life often from Breezy Melody One. And, oh, uh, oh wow, this is a heavy-duty wand with some heavy-duty birds that have little embroidered feathered wings. They are really pretty. Wow, I hope you can see it well enough in the package. I don't want to take it out um, because I'll probably ship it sometime next year. Uh, and I don't mean 2024. So uh, it is, it's wonderful though. It's got a, a, one of these wands that has the really sturdy spring steel on it that's long with a wooden handle. You can see here, and then the long spring steel. And then at the end, it's got a little clip on hook so you can put all kinds of toys on the end of it. And then we have five different wonderfully crafted birds that have a fuzzy body, super detailed with a beak and a little feather crest on the top of the head. Each one has a different little pattern and they each have a little embroidered thing next to their wings um, and the wings themselves are like real feathers and they have real feather tails. That is a really nice uh, toy set actually. And it just says six pieces cat wand bird toy so good luck uh, searching for that if you want one. But uh, Breezy Melody one, this is really nice and I'm going to write if I have a pen here, which I ought to, I do, I'm going to write Squall and Welly right on it and then put it in the closet of to-do. Perfect. Squall plus Welly. Uh, these are really, that's a, that's a very well, fun if, cat wand toy. If uh -huh. you are, you're collecting things to ship? I, I will, yeah. I have a then big collection. Send them the thing, too. Which thing? The round thing, the bed, the taco bed that just came. Didn't that also come No, I mean, it was, I don't know if it was for them or not. If it is, then great. Yeah, we can send it to them. Um, I guess, let us know. Breezy Melody One, you know how to get in touch with me. Let me know if the bed's for them. If it is, we will include it and what to send to them. And you don't have to worry about us not having one to deploy because I'm pretty sure we've got one in storage that's new that could be deployed at any time. Uh, Probably the only reason that it hasn't been is that uh, DJ never gets around to seeing what's down there. Uh, but we were just talking about making that our next project um, as of this morning, so soon. This says, wow, this could be um, either super late or it's from 
um, because it says attention Millet and Sydney. So let's find out. <laughs> I think it's from them. Yes, it's not for them, but but uh, it could go either way. All right, let's see. Enjoy your gift. All right. Well, let's just. Uh, oh, there we go. For drizzle. Okay. So that answers it all. From uh, obviously Millet and Sydney. For drizzle, and drizzle gets a little dragon that says bendy buddy, bendable catnip <laughs> toy to carry, bat and chase, and apparently also sea animal cat. Oh, this is. This has got, uh, I think this was sent because it's got it's a, lobster a lobster in it. I don't think it's the same lobster, but it is a lobster it. that might fool her. Her other lobster is still around somewhere, but it has become a little threadbare piece of just rag. Like it is. And then actually, I do know where her envelope is. The original envelope is in the toy drawer under the microwave. Okay. Safe for whenever she gets adopted. Um, yeah, but she probably can't play with it. But I do so want to see. Just take it with yeah, her. Let's just find out right now if she's interested. Oh, this is cute though. It does have a little bit of a string and these little things on it. I like it. She's eating these treats, by the way, now that everybody else has tried some. They do need to be broken up a little bit for these guys because otherwise they're big. But about a quarter size is about right for them. Here, take mm -hmm. that with you when you go. Does that look familiar? She's like, I don't know. It doesn't smell like my horrible, disgusting lobster that's been through <laughs> so much awfulness. Uh, we'll see. And if she doesn't pick it up before mailbag's over, I'll just put it back in the bag to go with her endowments. And I'm going to write drizzle right on this. Good. And I know she will get her endowments in due time uh, when it is uh, when she's adopted. So, okay. Those were the not for mailbag ones, so I've got to leave those over there. Actually, I'll put them in this pile of things to take upstairs with me. Excellent. Next up, we have, oh, from Astro. Mm -hmm. All right, what has Astro sent? Uh, huh. <laughs> Astro's too funny. Yes, Astro is too funny. <laughs> hey! What are you doing? Oh, you want her to play? Julia? She's trying to get somebody to play with her. Uh, I think she's about to jump on Ari. You know, she's thinking about it. She decided against it's good. Discretion is the better part of valor. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, we got some tissues in here. Very colorful box. And the note right front and center on top. Thank you very much for that. With a little heart. And it says... Ooh, it's a beautiful photo of, <laughs> it's a beautiful photo of just a lovely tabby, uh, like a dark colored tabby like, like our till here, and holding and licking a candy cane. Then there's a checkbox, it's a checkbox for naughty and a checkbox for nice, and the nice one is checked. Oh, and it is actually a photo of Astro. I can tell now because the Art Deco border has Astro written in a very Art Deco style. And then in the corner, there's a disclaimer that says, paid actor portrayal, not a real candy cane. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is wonderful. On the inside, we have the naughty and nice boxes, but naughty is checked. On the outside, it's checked with, by the paw print. And on the inside, it's checked by a human naughty. <laughs> Uh, very cute. Super cute. Paid actor portrayal, not a real candy cane. No trees were harmed in the making of this card. Also, we have Astro's paw prints here. Mm -hmm. And signing the card. Wow. And it says it's a wonder a big wonder for life. <laughs> okay to read on stream. Happy holidays, dear Mr. A, Dr. DJ, faculty, and students. I apologize for this arriving so late. I guess it's hard to rush. Astro perfection. I wanted to thank you again for all you do and have done, especially for raising the most perfect little boy who has blessed my life more than I could ever say. I will never be able to thank you enough um, to try. I sent you a treat, Mr. A. I know you told me you've spent some time in Wisconsin, so I sent you some sarugis to share with DJ. The best chocolate and a true Northeast Wisconsin tradition. Thank you again, and I hope you enjoy. Warm wishes this holiday season from Astro Labe and his humans. Oh, Astro's nose print. He likes to sniff. Wow. Oh, that's so cute. From Danny and Astro. 
P.S. I helped lick the envelopes, Astro. <laughs> <laughs> This is a, an amazing photo of Astro with the candy cane. It's just wonderful. I love everything about this. Wow. Uh, the paw print is, I mean, the nose print is uh, extra, extra special. Very cute. And I'm going to try to toss this to DJ so she can have a close look at it. Now, I didn't spend very much time in the northeast part of Wisconsin. Just a t like, I'm, probably my time like in the Green Bay area could be measured in hours. Uh, so I'm not entirely familiar with Sarugis, but uh, somewhere in here we're going to find out. There we go. Ooh. All right, it looks like uh, an eclectic collection of various chocolates. Ooh, a pretzel that is covered in green and gold. I wonder what that could be about. <laughs> uh, then we have some, ooh, like chocolate melt-away bar. And, oh, another one, red and green colored chocolate melt-away bars. That's yummy, yummy stuff, I know. We have a chocolate snowflake. We have uh, chocolate, oops, just throw that out away. Uh, we have Did you read his message in the back? Oh, no, I didn't see one on the back. Should I read it to everybody? Do you want to read it to everybody? I think you can read it from I, right Not there. from there, I know. What are you kidding me? <laughs> meow, meow, meow. Oh, meow. I see. It's entirely in his meow, words. Meow. Yes. Oh, well, you're best to read that anyway, but I think we It's get the so idea cute. if you don't want to. All right, we have two uh, chocolate bombs. Or maybe they're Christmas tree ornaments. Okay, they're Christmas tree ornaments. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, it says, oh, oh chocolate-covered Oreos. What? Well, I guess I can have these. Uh, we have uh, chocolate Wisconsin. All right. Wow. When you've said Wisconsin, you've said it all. Uh, uh, Melt-away mint mocha. And then we have two of Sarugi's. Uh, caramels that look really yummy. You want a caramel right now? These look like they're very dark in color, so I'm assuming that they're like extra, extra caramelized. Mm. Mm. Sure. You want me to throw you one right, right now? Okay. Ooh. Oh man, you almost. almost got it. Almost. Yeah. Oh, these look fantastic. All right. Here. Wait, where does this go? Well, it will go in the pile of cards here, so that's good. Well, those are perfect for me. I'm going to put them right over here with my workout candy bars. There we go. And now we have both kinds. This is from Pound Cake. That's the, uh, the pound with the E and the Y, the old ye olde style, as I always say. And Pound Cake has sent, ah, Mylar Balls. You can never have too many Mylar Balls. Mm -hmm. Let's see what the note says. Oh, for Squall's Endowment. Ah, oh, thank you very much, Pound Cake. Uh, much appreciated. I'm going to write Squall right on it and add it to the growing pile of things that we probably should have opened for Squall in advance. Um, where did I put the pen? It went back in the box. That's good. That's very organized. So, Squall. Q-U-A-L-L. -L. I know how to spell. I know how to spell. Don't tell me. All right. Perfect. Right there. Barry, you can hold that for me. Thank you. Perfect. Next up. All right. Uh, well, nothing on the outside to clue us in. Let's see. Oh, aha. We got the envelope in an envelope. The uh, post office has done this to me before when I package something myself, and then they're like, you used the wrong one. <laughs> so that might be what's going on here. Oh, good job, Till. Hey, Tilly. This looks like a cat bag. Oh, wow, these are some very cool shop... Oh, wait, not just shopping bags. It's also a kitchen set of, uh, like, a pot holder and a matching towel. That's a very pretty color. Uh... And then the bag, it has a really cool cat face on it, and <coughs> it's very shiny. Look at that, super shiny. Okay, stand that up for a second and read this card that has a beautiful cut-out Christmas tree ornament in red and gold and white. 
And you can see that's cut out, so you can see the card through it. And the card has two little birdies kissing in a heart on this side. And on the inside, oh my goodness, such t neat handwriting. It says, hey, Mr. A and Dr. DJ, it's your favorite fan, Crystal, from last year. And I hope you all had a wonderful Christmas and will have an outstanding new year. Congrats on signing Teaspoon to tenure at Catton Academy. I want, yeah, I'm Kitten Academy. I don't know why I read that as Catton. You didn't write Catton. Uh, congrats on signing Teaspoon to tenure at Kitten Academy. I want to thank you again for what you do for those cats and kittens. With the shelters being crowded, it's nice to know that there are people like you and DJ who are opening your heart and home to them. Like last year, I wanted to send you all, some, all something useful and cute. I've included two more cat-inspired dish towels along with a catty-like oven mitten that matches. I saw these in the store and couldn't pass them up. Hope it lights up and brightens your kitchen as long as the adult cats don't snatch it and try to tear it up. Again, thank you for sharing Kitten Academy with us and I will continue to peek in on my unplanned breaks at work. From KA fan and donor Crystal, P.S. Cat bag is for DJ to carry her things to the hospital if she chooses. Well, thank you. That's very sweet. And uh, yeah, bags are great, especially these days when uh, Connecticut now charges you for shopping bags if you don't bring your own. So we get to use those all the time. Uh, and this pot holder is really adorable. It's, the kittens on this look so... They've all got really cute little expressions on their faces. Uh, really oh, beautiful. Look! Oh, oh so in the bag. <laughs> Take a picture. I, uh, Quick. Too cute. Sprout, you're so silly. Mm. Sprouty. Sprout, Sprout, what are you doing? Hi, Sprout. Yeah. Oh, okay, coming out already, or I could have moved those boxes, but at least I got a couple pictures to post on Discord real quick. <laughs> I'm glad you saw that. Silly. Silly Sprout. Uh oh. There's some is good Is she photos biting there. that? She is biting the, uh, the bag. Oh, but she can't. Yeah. There we go. Okay. So, let's put this right over here in the pile of things for me to uh, put upstairs or in the kitchen. Ooh, this has come a long way from New Zealand, um, and it looks like it is from Missy May. So, let's see. We're going to have to use a little bit of knife here, but I've got to be careful because it feels like there could be something cuttable inside. Oh, it's cardboard. That's fine. Nice knife guard. And instructions on how to open the cardboard. Oh, that makes my life so much easier. Okay, so it's open there. Perfect. All right, what have we got? Oh my goodness, it's layers. It's, it's good. It had a long way to go, so it's, it's wonderful that it's so protected. And first we have a card that says, card is okay to read on stream. So that's a perfect start. Um, hang on here. You guys want to give them a tissue box? It's not big enough for you, really, but, you know, you guys can have some fun here. Hang on. Let me do this. Oh, do you want ants? Because this is how you get ants, kids. Is there another one of those caramels? There's exactly one more. Did you like it? Yeah, it's really good. Uh, let's see. That would be in this bag. From Astro. Yes. Oh, nice. You got it that time. Very mm -hmm. good. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see. This says, card is okay for reading on stream. That's great. <gasps> Oh, what cute faces. This looks like some familiar faces right here. And it says... Who's in the kitchen doing things? I do hear something getting banged around in the kitchen. Someone's cooking. Okay, uh, okay to read on stream, not for stream. Someone's okay, good. The card says, Hi, Mr. A and Dr. DJ. We wish you both a happy Christmas and New Year. Hopefully you get to spend some time together at That's Christmas. Great. Wishing you a happy and peaceful Christmas and New Year. P.S. As we were a little late due to some logistics issues, we can say the calendar family look lovely. Uh, and, of course, our gift was totally incidental to the family's name. All right. 
Happy Christmas from Lulu. And here we've got uh, some、mm-hmm. really cute kittens. Uh, what、pipe. happened to this cactus with the little kitten that had? I remember it, how funny it was、uh, because the little kitten was anatomically detailed on the cactus.、Um, that cracked me up quite a bit.、Uh, also, this this looks like teaspoon right here on the front, but it's not because I don't recognize the background. But it's such a, a similarity, isn't it? Right. Is not? I don't think it can be. I mean, what could that have been taken against?、Hmm. On the other hand, it almost has to be. <laughs> it can't be. His ears are too big. Can I see that? It's just a just a coincidence that he、mm. looks so much alike. Oh, there we go. Okay. So this says okay to read on stream. So let's carry right on. Hi, Mr. A and DJ. We wanted to say hi and thanks for all you do for the cats and kittens that come your way. Here, do you want to read this part that says not for stream? Maybe it has a clue. Here. Hmm. This is this is、um, oh I see. This is Wellington. It is. Yeah, that's what I thought too. But I also didn't recognize that background. It's a different background. Yeah, it looks like they've been photoshopped. That's really cute. Ah,、mm-hmm. and it is them, I think. So、um, that's beautiful. Ah,、oh, all the、really、way from、cool. New Zealand. Um, yeah, so this this gives away the fact that it is them, which is wonderful. Oh, you also give it away here. Good.、Uh, you say. Um, we wanted to say hi and thanks for all you do for the cats and kittens that come your way. We know you hear that a lot, but we do mean it. We're not the most active Discorders, written conversation-wise, but we love following and reading what's happened in the many and varied channels. Thanks to you and the community you have created, it's a good place to come after a stressful day at work. On the card, if you think it looks like a teaspoon, then it is. <laughs> He's just asking for some Christmas dinner. And if you think it looks like a squall with her brother Wellingtons, then it probably is. The pictures are modified ones you've taken. I had some fun using Photoshop and their AI fill tool, plus、nice. a wee bit of artistic license around modifying your original photos. I've enclosed the original so you can see the before and after. Lulu is my cat.、Uh, Discord name Sumatra eighteen, and she just wanted to say Happy Christmas to you as well. The calendar, well, not of cats. We thought this was just something a little different. That must be what's in the envelope here.、Um, at least it's not food and won't interfere with your new workout regime. Thank you. <laughs> Sorry, it's not a fancy gadget, which we know you like. But NZ is a bit behind the times, and a fancy gadget here is a pull-along wooden toy called a Buzzy Bee.、Uh, that does look really cute, actually. The pull-along Buzzy Bee.、Um, It reminds me. Wow! You say wooden toy that's got these wheels on it, and I just had this vivid memory of a childhood friend of mine, and I would visit him at his house, and his parents had this toy that was just a. It was a dumb little wooden toy that was a duck. It was a cutout wooden duck, and it had wheels,、um, and the, attached to each wheel on the duck was a rubber flap that was cut out like in the shape of a duck. Um, paw, uh, uh, foot, whatever.、Uh, it was a duck foot. So the wheels had these little rubber flaps that were duck feet, and then it had a long handle so you could roll it along the floor without bending over or being on the floor from like you know from waist height. Hey, hey, hey! hey, hey, hey. That's enough of that, Till. All right, maybe it's time for Till to go in her room and Logan to come out because she looks like she doesn't want to stop. Hey, hey, Till, Till. Okay, it's okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Time to take a chill, Till. Chill, chill. She's gonna run away from me upstairs now. Hang on one sec. Hi, Till. I know you guys can still hear me.、Uh, come on, come on, come on. No, no, no. She's like, I, I don't want to go back. I just don't want drizzle around. Who can come with me? All right, come on. All right, good opportunity for、uh, Logan to get out. So you already put Serenity away earlier, right, TJ? Yes. Okay. Come on, Logie. I know you want it out. It's your turn. Come on, you win. Boop. There we go. Wow, she was fed up. Uh oh. Looks like we got an intruder over here. Doesn't look like an ant. Hmm. I'm、What? sorry. What do you mean? Oh, did I get him? I don't know. 
Does it look like a silverfish? Those things are creepy. I can't. I just can't. I'm sorry. <laughs> look the other way, everybody. Okay. All right. Let's continue. Sorry for the interruption. Interruptions. Okay. Uh, oh yeah, the wooden. Uh, I was talking about that duck. It doesn't even matter. But I just I love the way. So the, what because it was had the, that? because it had the little rubber feet on the wheel, and you could push it along the ground. You'd push it, and the wheels would turn, and the little rubber feet would hit the ground and make this like slap, 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 slap noise. Well, it was it was so funny. Uh, it just I just loved playing with it. It's just a dumb little wooden toy, and I wasn't that young. I'm not like a little tiny kid at this point. I was in middle school, um, but it was just the coolest little thing. <laughs> Uh, so that, uh, for some reason, that reminds me of this one. This one doesn't have the big handle on it, but you can see it's got like little wings that turn when the, you move the wheels along the ground, the buzzy bee. Mm, so, hey, I'm wearing the t-shirt. It says I'm allowed to ramble. So you got it. Uh, so let's see. Um, uh, <laughs> uh, so you say the calendar is not a cast. We thought this was something a little different. At least it's not food and won't interfere with your new workout regime. Sorry, it's not a fancy gadget, which we know you like, but NZ's a bit behind the times in a fancy gadget. Here's a pull-along wooden toy called a Buzzy Bee. Just joking, as I do have something you would love, and that is fiber internet connection right at the gate. Oh, I'm super jealous now. Oh, that just is depressing. The pictures in the calendar are all places in New Zealand's South Island that I have visited. The photos are ones taken by me. Discord name Missy May. They aren't AI generated. They are real places and real pictures from Sumatra 18 and Missy May, the NZ sisters. Wow. Oh my gosh. Well, that makes it even more special that it is your photos. And also, aha, there's the original reference photos for the AI work that you've done. Very cool. I got to tell you, I mean, I've mentioned it in passing and I don't have to go off on a tangent because I don't even know what I'd say, but uh, I am just huge into AI and experimenting with the new stuff that we can do. It's mind blowing. What It's it's a huge change in, in everything. And I don't know if everybody realizes yet how big it's going to have been. Wow, that's some complex, tense work there. Okay, uh, so 2024 calendar photos around New Zealand's South Island. This is lovely, lovely landscape photography. Wow. I'm surely going to mispronounce these locations, but there's Mangatini Falls. Beautiful waterfalls. Oh, this is, this is amazing. Wow. You're such a great photographer, too. Mosses and lichens. This is very three-dimensional. I don't think uh, I've seen lichens that grow out like this around here. Um, beautiful too. Well, I've, I've got to take a look at all of this. Um, oh, there's also some apparently New Zealand holidays listed on the calendar, like Wai Tangi Day. Wai uh, Tangi Day. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but that's interesting too. Puna Kaiki Pancake Rocks Blowholes. Oh man, that is an amazing photo, and that just looks like something that would be stunning to see in what real is life. What's the teaspoon? Look at that. Can you can you make that out from here? Yeah. It's blowholes where the, the water comes and yeah. hits the rocks and then shoots up. And, really cool. Oh, wow. Like, okay, I'll look through the whole thing, but not, not right meow. Uh, thank you so much. That's beautiful. I'm, I'm very excited to have a look at the rest of your uh, amazing artwork. Wow. Okay. Teaspoon, what are you trying to do? Where what? is he? Oh, I can't see him He's from here. He's on the table there. Good. What is it? He's talking too. There's food up there still, right? Or, no, no, you I put, put it, it away. away. That's what he wants then. You can't have that food, buddy. <laughs> oh, I you, should check oh, him. Oh, don't, don't be sad. <laughs> don't be sad. He, he just made a meow. He now. looks right into your soul. He's got these I eyes know. that he makes Let's hard eye contact with people. He, like some Can cats I, won't really look in your I eyes. Go get your food. Teaspoon has no compunctions. Yeah. He he looks directly so through your it's eyes so and into your soul. It's a, uh, so it's really sweet. something. Okay, um, this does not have anything on the outside, and it's very purple. Don't forget your mic still works when you're up there. Okay. So she doesn't say or go in the bathroom or something. Very easy to forget that stuff. Okie dokie. 
Um, let's see. I see. Oh, oh my goodness! Wow, this must have come from further away than I realized. It's just a standard priority mail envelope, though. You have your regular. I just got to check the return address real quick. Come on. Hmm, no, it uh, it did get shipped domestically. I guess that's all I'll say about that. But it is not uh, domestic media here. We have. Uh, I honestly, I wouldn't even be able to tell you what this is. <laughs> <laughs> it's a paper, though, that I'm going to be super excited to read the ads on, and hopefully this note will have some more uh, clues, but I think this, even though I don't recognize Lejona, um, I'm surely mispronouncing, I would bet a dollar that this is some of that salted licorice uh, that is so delicious. <laughs> so let's find out. Um, okay. To Kitten Academy, happy holidays from Finland. Perfect. Well, that does explain a few things. To all faculty, current Tiny's mom cats, that's you, Mr. A, and DJ. Love Talvi. Talvi? Tal Talvi? Talvi? All right. I don't even know. I'm not going to pretend like I know. Safe to read on stream. I've been watching KA since early utensils now, and it has become my daily routine to check how the kittens are and see if there is any fun shenanigans going. I've had some rough time this year, but waking up and being able to follow the kittens all day has been steadily making me feel better every day. Mr. A and DJ, you both do such important and respected jobs with the, all these kittens. I can't thank you enough for what you do and what you all share with us. Since you are an avid lover of salmiaki, I, which I, it's probably not how you pronounce that either, I thought to send you some more. Hey, well, that's exactly what I thought it was. Take it as a thanks. Also, I know you can't read it, but I know you love local newspapers. Have a newspaper from Finland. Uh, regards, Talvi. Talvi, thank you so much. This is very sweet, and this is going to be a lot of fun for me, even if I can't read it directly. If there's anything that looks especially interesting, I can have Google read it for me. Um, but even without that, it's fun to just sort of look through it and see um, the photos and guess at what's going on. And the ads, too. And, uh, oh, an interesting word puzzle here. Sort of a crossword, but it's very dense. Uh, hey, something like that. Hmm. Well, now I don't even know what it is. But there's money attached to each one. Maybe winners of something. A game. Uh, I don't know. There's other games in here, too. That's fun. Wow. Hyper Sudoku. All right, taking it to the next level. Thank you so much, Talvi. And I I'm have to try one of these right now because it has been a long time. And uh, I just want to see if this one is um, different because it's not the same brand. Cute, it's tiny. Oh. Hmm. Oh, there it is. It does have a little bit of that tar flavor to it, which I actually liked in the one that had the tar. Hmm. Hmm. Well, it's definitely one of those like um, things that you, I think you have to grow up with to truly appreciate. Yeah. Okay. Um, and I've never been a fan of black licorice in the first place. I guess just licorice in general. Although I've gotten a little more used to the licorice <laughs> flavor because when you go to the Indian restaurants, they all have... Um, uh, what is that spice that, that they have uh, for you to freshen your breath with when you leave? Um, mm -hmm. What? Fennel. Fennel, that's what I was going to say, yeah. Which has a very licorice flavor, doesn't it? You don't think so? I don't know licorice, so... I think I think fennel um, has always tasted somewhat that way. So uh, it's a little familiar, anyway. Mm. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm, everybody's like, what is wrong with Mr. A and his taste buds? Um, which is a fair question. So <laughs> let's keep rolling. We just got a couple more boxes here. Thank you so much for this. It's actually not bad. Again, I don't think I would go out of my way um, to get any, but it's a fun little experience. I would recommend it to anyone who was adventurous mm. or Scandinavian. Um, oh, Loganberry's going to finish off some of these treats, too. Everybody has come over here and tried them, but there's still at least one, one whole treat worth of treat parts over here. <laughs> okay, I'm going to put that right in there. Good. All right, Dalby, thank you so much. And I, ho I hope everything is going better for you and for everyone. I know that 
Um, there have been a lot of rough times for a lot of people the last few years, and uh, I just I just hope that all of us are managing to see the light. Uh, the light at the end of the tunnel sounds too fatalistic. What is the what is the hopeful phrase that I'm looking for there? The silver lining? No, that's not it either. Well, whatever it is, um, I hope things go well uh, for you and for all of us. All right, uh, enjoy your gift for Kitten Academy from a name I should know. Um, I, I think this is um, Millet's adopter, but I'm not positive. So let's see if there's another, because I'm not good with names in the first place. Yes, this is Millet and Sydney. Ha ha. I would never have gotten that if there wasn't just the other thing from them. Uh, believe me, if there was no context. This is a really cool bag. Um, I'm used to seeing the Amazon gift bags, but I haven't seen this one before with the bright yellow ribbon. It, uh, they've, they've, it really stands out. It's a nice look. You two, what is going on today, kids? All riled up. So, uh, from Millet and Sydney. Oh, hey, hey, look at that. Not only is that a gift bag, but it's a reusable bag oh. bag. Now, this is smart, Amazon. Yeah. Oh, bravo. Well done. Such a, such a simple little addition to the Amazon gift bag uh, that makes it so much more useful and less garbage, you know? I approve. Millet and Sydney, though, uh, that was, I think, the only note, so... Let's see. Well, it's wrapped up in hearts, whatever it is. But we still haven't gotten to the bottom of this mystery. Ooh, I like what the label says. Let's find out. Just one out. This one. Oh, oh, what's he in? The room. Ah. Mm -hmm. Oh, you put him in there so he can eat something? Yeah. That makes sense. I guess you can hear him from all the way upstairs. He would be, like, directly above her where she was sitting, so maybe she hey, didn't hear that. Do you want to go out? I'm sorry. Okay. Well, we're getting in there. This is supposed to come just undone when you pull on the string, right? I recognize the way this is braided, but I, I've never been able Ready, to buddy? work these correctly. Go back down. Mm -hmm. Pulling on the wrong end of it? All right. I give up. I'm just going to cut this thing open. Wow, that is a sturdy Mylar bag right there. Rip stop. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying my hardest to open this without cutting into what's inside. There we go. That, uh, that licorice is still with me. Like, those things don't just go away. But it's stuck now to my tooth. Pardon me. Okay. Still working on it. Hmm. Instructions. Okay. This is, according to the label, a stuffed unicorn cat. Oh, and it's inflating. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Oh, my goodness. I, this is not... I don't know what I was expecting. Uh, that's really cute. Oh, my gosh. It's exactly what it says mm -hmm. on the label. Uh, and I think it's going to... I can feel like it's all lumpy because it needs some time to really get expanded fully. Um, which the instructions said... Um, and also we can take the fluff filling out. There's a zipper. Um, great. Machine wash and hand wash are okay. Oh, perfect. Wow. Well, that's just great on every level. There's some very, um, wow, that filling is, uh, let's just take a look since it says we can take it out. And, oh, well, what? This is not, I thought, I thought the filling seemed a little lumpy. Um, it's more than that. Let me just see if there's any clue about this anywhere. There's not any clue. Okay, well, I thought the feeling felt a little oddly lumpy, so I would take a look. And in fact, it's got little baby cat unicorns inside it. <laughs> How cute! Oh, it's a mom cat unicorn. Wow. And uh, here, look, here I am helping deliver kittens uh, live during mailbag. I hope DJ remembers that her mic works. DJ? All right, well, you know what? 
Uh, if she says or does something embarrassing, it wouldn't be the first time that's happened to someone. Um, that's so funny and cute. Uh, I don't know why the instructions say, um, there's a zipper on the back, take it, find it, take out some filling, make it fluffy, then put it in. So I thought that's what I was going to do, but no, there's also a zipper on the belly. Is there a zipper on the back? No, oh, I think the zipper on the back is just a lie. There's not one. Interesting, interesting, interesting from every angle, but uh, it's so pretty. I just, it's cute, it's adorable, it's rainbow, it's got a happy face, and it's a mom cat unicorn. Um, that's, that's really, really adorable. Thank you so much for that. I don't know exactly where we're going to put it yet, but, um, uh, well, uh, you know, I think it's, I think it's cute. Uh, I'm going to put the little babies right back inside because I, I don't know where else to put them right now either. <laughs> I know we've had plenty of the little babies that wish they could just go back. They all come out like, oh, this is a terrible idea. Okay, this is really cute, and certainly once I deploy the entire like rainbow unicorn theme that I've been building up, this could be a wonderful part of it, but I'd like to put it somewhere where I can enjoy it even before that, maybe my office for a while. It's so cute. Uh, okay, one more box. DJ's been up there for a while. The longer she's up there, the more nervous I am about her forgetting the mic. But uh, what are you going to do? I think she's hyper aware of those things anyway, usually. she uh, The minute I put the mic on her, she just stopped talking. <laughs> uh, let's see. I, is there... Oh, there's a note right on top. Okay, good. This is uh, also wrapped in interesting bags. Oh, okay. Hiding address. Oh, thank you. You hid your own address. I like that. Aw, this is very cute. Now I recognize who this is from. Uh, it says here, Happy Holidays, and it's got pictures of some KA alum with love from John, Kelsey, Trout, Garby, Izzy, and Wren. Very cute photos of them for the holidays. And what on earth have you sent, though? Um, okay. That's just shipping instructions, which obviously were followed since this has arrived. We have two Amazon gift bags here. Happy holidays. We miss you all so much. Trout and Garby want to visit soon. Stay warm, and we love y'all. Love, wear, Ginge. Idle thought, Trout and Garby. Indeed. And uh, the other one, I assume, would say the same thing. Yes, it does. All right, let's see what we have. These must be the new style bags. This has a different pattern or lack of pattern, but it's just as pretty. The yellow ribbon is a nice touch on the blue. Zoom, zoom. Zoom. Wait, this looks familiar. We didn't we get something from this brand recently? Bedsure get cozy. Bedsure essentials. Yes, I'm I'm sure I saw I'm bed sure I saw something like this recently, but I can't place it. Ooh, oh, it's a beautiful, I believe, Christmas cat blanket, bed, bl bl bled, 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 bed blanket. I, I don't know what to call this. Hang on, let's check the other one to see if it's the same, and then maybe we just have to open one to get a good look at it. This is from uh, Wear Ginge and Trout and all. Aww. I hope you didn't forget your mic was on upstairs. Yeah, no. Okay, I good. I was just worried about this it since you were gone for a while. There is a button on the side. If you press it and the light turns red, then it's off. Oh, that's fine. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. Put that out again. Uh, this is sticking here. Hang on. Okay, what is the matter? <laughs> there we go. Got it. Okay, this does also say bed sure. And, ah, Similar, maybe, but it's certainly a different color. Well, it's hard to say, actually, if they're the same. I think they're wonderful, soft blankets. Uh, let's just find out. They look very fuzzy. 
right in the box. Buddy, you want me to put the tissue in that slightly bigger box for you? Oh, look how lovely so this is. Oh, oh, it's better than a blanket. Oh, it's, it's like a big that. old fluffy cozy thing that you can wear to keep warm. That's, That's uh, awesome. got a very Christmas theme to it and a hood. Oh, that does look awesome. Wow, it looks so warm. I used to have a big fuzzy thing that I would wear yeah, all the, the blue time. T-shirt. Yeah, the blue, the blue big, the big blue thing. thing. Uh, I think it's been retired for some time, but this is an excellent replacement for it. And I wonder now then if this is another one or if this is. Mm -hmm. Hi, buddy. Mm -hmm. Oh, these look so soft. I can't wait. Yes, indeed. This is another uh, in a more sort of cool color. What is box? Look how big that is. Oh, it's so nice. And you guys may have noticed that I've been walking around uh, often with a hat on uh, because it gets kind of chilly in the house, especially if I'm sitting around doing nothing. Like if I get up and start working on cleaning and stuff, then it's, I get hot and sweaty real fast. But Can if you I'm a teaspoon into it? sitting on my computer for a long time, as I often do, teaspoon. Uh, then I can get like freezing cold. Hi, pal. Are you looking for one of these treats? Are there still some under all this for you to try? There you are. Here, do you want to just try one of these, pal? Here. They heard me make that noise and ran in just to be like, I, I mean, uh, Sprout ran in to be just be like, wait, I already tried this stuff. He's you fooled me. Not are these uh, are these the same size or different sizes? Is there the one size yours. fits all? I think the blue is yours. You want the red one? I think it's smaller. Yeah, it does look a little smaller, but I was just wondering if there's a way to turn it, tell for sure. There's probably a size. There's a tag down here. Let's find out if there's a... Uh, they might not be sized. They might just be one size fits oh, all. Okay. I mean, it is awfully big. So, uh, it's super cute. Bed sure. Okay. Whoa, they're so soft. It's like a blanket you can wear. I am, I'm super excited to be wearing one of these or both of them. Uh, thank you. I'm just, I'm going to just stuff it in the box now. Okay, there we go. Thank you, uh, everybody, for everything. This has been a wonderful Christmas. I think this kind of wraps up the Christmas, probably, unless there's any straggling things that turn up later on. Uh, but that was everything. So... Um, it's just wonderfully generous to us, to the kittens. Uh, I'm excited about all of it. And, uh, oh, he's, he's really going to eat that. Good. Did you clean his bottom at any point? No, he did, I guess. Oh, I was, I can't tell if it's clean or not. I was just wondering if I have to clean it. Or he just sat somewhere. Yeah. Could have, could have left dirty prints someplace. <laughs> oh, teaspoon, our dirty prints. <laughs> He's really liking those treats, but then he's, he can be a little food fiend as long as it's not, you know, the food that he's required to eat. Let me check your colon, pal. Let's just feel you real quick, okay? Well, you feel completely clear now. Who knows if you had a blowout earlier? Eh. What? No, no, there's, there's nothing. He's pretty clear. Okay. All right, pal. Sorry. I'm sorry. The indignity here. You want to come back to your little applesauce and fish treats? All right. Well, thanks again, everybody. I'm going to get the regular mic on and uh, get this stuff put away. And then we will end the archive after, I'm sure. You just hit the button once and it should turn red, right? Yeah, perfect. All right, here we go.
boxes out of the way. So he doesn't jump at it and end up all over something weird. kind of set these cards out, but they were already falling over. Upstairs. Wow, they're big and they're so fuzzy.
you're still getting floofier. Oh, wow, you almost shot that at me. Star looks like a teaspoon and then give it away. Hey buddy, why do you look a little bit worried? So some tags are okay, huh? Yeah, because it's not like you know, something that was kind of It's integral. Yeah, this is this is goes downstairs. Okay, so you gotta clean this up. Eat it. Well, I know a vacuum cleaner would love to eat those treats. Why do you call them sugar? Yeah.
Uh, one last thanks, everybody. I'm going to come up here and vacuum this stuff, and then I realize the recording's still going. You're not going to want that, so uh, we'll end it here. Thanks again, everybody. Um, it's wonderful. Everything's wonderful. DJ's already wearing that fuzzy thing, and I'm looking forward to wearing mine as soon as I settle down for a minute. I took some fun pictures of DJ wearing hers because when she's standing with it on, it goes all the way to her ankles. It's, uh, it's pretty adorable. All right, that's the end of that recording.